Welcome to today's Player Spotlight, featuring all the new faces around the Empire Strikers. Today, we have a conversation with Damon Almazon, getting to know these new faces, brought to you by Cement Pro. Damon, first of all, congratulations and welcome to the Strikers. I just want to know immediately, how does it feel, your first chance to really get out there and put your face in front of the fans? Do you have anything you'd like to say to them, sir? Um, well... I am happy and excited to be coming to California. It's actually been one of my dream places to live. So I get to experience playing in front of our beautiful fans, and I'm excited for them to get to know me. Let's let the fans know a little bit about you. Can you tell us a little bit about where you grew up and when did the beautiful game enter your life and when did you fall in love with football soccer? So... I grew up born and raised in Joliet, Illinois, which is a suburb of Chicago. I started playing when I was three years old. My dad got me into the game at an early age. I started playing Park District, and when I was younger, actually, this is a funny story. My first ever soccer game, I scored on my own goal and cheered about it. My dad doesn't let me lift that down, by the way. Ever since then, I've been, you know, climbing up the ranks of club soccer with Chicago Magic and Wisconsin Red Stars. And I played one season of DA with FC United. Then I went on to sign Division One with Purdue Fort Wayne. Found out college wasn't for me. And I signed my first professional contract with Chicago House AC, which was third division in NISA. And last year I signed with Utica FC in Massel. So, yeah. So now, of course, you're coming from Utica. You're coming over to California, to Empire. You know this team. You know how tough the West Coast and those West Coast opponents can be. So what are your first impressions on the Empire Strikers and the team that you're joining? Well, I, I know the Empire is like, you know, like the spice. They like the Brazilian style of play, you know, very, you know, the area surrounded by cultured people with, you know, Latinos and everything like that, the Hispanic heritage. So I want to be able to showcase my skills with them because that's I, I would feel at home being around you know my people and what do you think uh your role is going to be with the strikers we know historically you've played in a midfield position is that what you're looking to do with empire i'm i'm an all-around player i'll play wherever coach puts me I, of course i'm going to ball out and showcase what i got but most importantly i'm i'm coming to learn i'm going to learn off the rookies i'm going to learn off the veterans i'm going to learn off the new players. I'm gonna learn off everybody. I'm 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 coming to learn off players, whether it's on the field or off the field. Um that's that's how I'm gonna get better as a player. When you look at your own game, what are some of the skills you expect Empire Strikers fans to be checking out throughout the course of this season? What what's what's your forte? I'm I'm a samba player. I like showing a little bit of class as well as showboating. So you're going to see me play with a smile. You're going to see me try stuff out of the norm. You're going to you're going to you're just going to see me be happy on that field. So I expect I hope seeing all that, all the you know, enjoying the show is going to make all the fans happy. Oh, sounds like Philly and I are going to have to set an over under on how many megs you give us this season. <laughs> um, so looking forward no, no, to that. So no, you'll, you'll have to you have to tally up how many times I'm going to get kicked. Uh, thankfully, uh, we have a statistician, Bill Norris, best in the game, that's going to handle all that for me. Thank goodness I don't have to keep track of that while we're broadcasting. Uh, we know that the goals for this team are obviously to hoist a championship at the end of the year, make a strong run in the playoffs. But as far as personal goals for yourself for this season, do you have any set? And if so, what are they? It's just, you know, to learn off the off the everybody. Like, I'm going, I'm going there, you know, obviously I want, you know, brotherhood with my teammates I want you know them to I want to earn their respect and I want them to respect me on the field as well but I'm there to learn off of them I don't want like I I come off as the way I play I come off oh he thinks you know he's so good like yeah I'm a good player but I'm there to like learn off you like I want I want to be a role model for the younger players and in order for me to be a role model at a young age I have to look up to the older players so that's what I'm going into it as. That's my main goal. I want to click with my coach. I want to click with all the staff. I want to 
I want to be the guy that everyone knows. Oh, he's always walking around with a smile. He's he loves being here because I love the game and I'm excited to bring my love for the game to Empire Strikers. And best believe I'm gonna be at every practice early, working before the work. So season is going to start off with a difficult stretch of games uh after a road trip down to mexico where you got to face monterey and the reigning champion chihuahua savage you then have to come home and our home opener december 15th against the reigning eastern conference champion baltimore blast have you had a chance to think about that home opener what it's going to feel like to play in front of the crowd for the first time have you had a chance to scout the blast in baltimore's lineup and is there any particular matchup you're looking forward to um, I haven't gave it much thought about the home opener only because I'm a, I'm a player that likes thinking of one game at a time. That's just how I perform my best. But just thinking of all the fans watching me play does give me goosebumps. Like I got goosebumps right now, <laughs> but that's probably the most thing, you know, what I'm excited for is to be able to perform every single game, every single practice. So, yeah. Well, I can't wait to see you introduced in front of the seventh man and, and let the crowds give you a chance to have a proper introduction. But along the lines of getting to know a little bit a bit more about you, my last question is, is off the subject of football. So you don't have to sweat this one too much. I'm right. curious to know, what does a perfect night out for you look like? Where are you going to dinner? What are you doing? And who's going to be with you if you're having the best night out? Okay, so, oh, wow, that's a tough one. I don't go out much only because I'm always busy and always tired. But when I do go out, I like dancing. Damon, it has been an absolute pleasure getting to know you. I can't wait for us to get a chance to explore our friendship and our partnership here with the Empire Strikers a little bit further once the season gets going. And I certainly can't wait to call what I'm hoping are some amazing plays from you throughout the course of this year. So thank you so much for joining us. Welcome to Empire. And it's been a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you for having me.